The amount of activity in downtown Detroit is surprising. This according to new data that shows the rise in activity compared to before the pandemic. Detroit's recovery ranks 50th out of 62 cities with jobs in finance and transportation on the rise while the hospitality industry declined. CBS Detroit's Lauren Winfrey has more on the downtown Detroit's post pandemic rebound. From the sleepy streets of a deserted downtown during the city's pandemic shutdown. When you walk down the streets of downtown now, depending upon the day and the season, you will see varying amounts of people. To post pandemic building in a city some now consider a destination location. Anyone that comes here, they're absolutely floored. Dennis Archer Jr., a lawyer, leveraged his background in marketing and advertising to create a portfolio of companies. He's also the creator and managing partner of Central Kitchen and Bar, a local restaurant conveniently located downtown. He says don't call the current hustle and bustle of the city a comeback. I, uh, I never use the word comeback. Uh, it's become a common phrase that people use, but I would just say Detroit's never gone anywhere. The activity or lack thereof in downtown Detroit during the pandemic compared to the activity happening now is nearly night and day. But have we fully recovered? We set out to find the answer. I always say it's the economy, stupid. Um, this is what really has made some cities resilient and other cities tank. Researchers from UC Berkeley and the University of Toronto gathered and analyzed mobile data in 62 cities to compare recent population patterns to pre pandemic numbers. Cities like Detroit, Chicago and Minneapolis ranked similarly. Dr. Karen Chappell is the director of the Urban Displacement Project, which aims to understand the nature of gentrification and displacement in American cities. The economy over specialized in tech has been turns out to be uh, make you less resilient. When looking at the data, Detroit ranks 50 with a 49% recovery rate. This means the city's downtown is rebounding, but perhaps not as quickly as other cities. Eric Larson with Downtown Detroit Partnership says he and his team have crunched the numbers too. Our visitor population, which was at about 33 million pre pandemic in 2019, is already back to pre-pandemic levels going into 2023. Larson served as CEO of the Downtown Detroit Partnership, or DDP, for nine years. According to DDP's metrics, in 2019, Downtown Detroit saw a median of more than 88,000 visits daily, excluding employees and residents. Saturday was the busiest day of the week for visitors. During the pandemic, those numbers dropped drastically, but since then, there's been a slow climb toward pre-pandemic numbers. People tend to invest and feel comfortable in places that are stable, where they can have consistency. Detroit has had that consistency over the last few years, and we want to continue to build on that. Reporting in Detroit, Lauren Winfrey, CBS News, Detroit.